Hey everybody, welcome back. Today we're going to find the length of a string. This is also something that's very useful, very, very, very much used in the industry. Uh, it might not seem important right now, but in the uh, long term, this kind of knowledge is going to be uh, exponentially useful. You can find uh, the length of a string value by writing dot length after the string uh, variable, uh, after the string variable or the string literal. Uh, variable or literal, what does that mean? The, if if you have a string, let's see, this would be the string literal, and then this would be a string variable. So the first name, if you were to go first name dot length, this is finding it based on a string variable. And if you were to say my like first name would be Ian dot length, this uh, like this would be a string literal, literal variable, because you're using a variable to get the length. You're getting the length of a string that's hidden in a variable, and this is literal. Hope that helps. Uh, for example, if we created a variable named first name Charles, we could find out how long the string Charles is by using str first name dot length. And so then in this example, they're using the uh, string variable. Uh, use dot length property to count the number of characters in the last name variable and assign it to the last name length. Okay, last name length, last name variable. Okay, yeah, last name length is equal to zero. And so last name length, last name, right now it's set to zero. Uh, the last name is loveless. Oh wow, so all the way they want us to do is call the dot length uh, on there. And so if we run the test, I think that that should pass. Um, I think another cool way to think about this is if you follow around, you can go uh, console.log and you can say, let's say, um, their um, country, United States of America. Right? So if we were to find the length of the country, we go country dot length. This should spit out however many numbers or character letters are in here. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24. And so that's why we get the number 24 right here. So that's how you get the length. Uh, I hope me going into a little bit greater detail was helpful. Uh, this isn't required for passing the tests, but it's fun to think about. Hope this is helpful. See you guys in the next lesson.